Big shout out to Sporting Icons, best channel out there. Okay, so what is happening with Andy Rich Jr. versus Deontay Wilder? Deontay Wilder last fought when he took on Robert Hellenius on the 15th of October. So coming up four months now. Andy Rich Jr. hasn't fought since the 4th of September when he beat Luis Ortiz. So over five months now. What is happening over there with that fight? This fight was a created fight by the PBC, which the WBC quite clearly sanctioned and called it Eliminators. Andy Rich Jr. versus Luis Ortiz, Deontay Wilder versus Robert Hellenius, winners fight each other, final eliminator to become the WBC mandatory, right? We've covered all that. So therefore, this fight is going to happen, right? If the PBC say so, then it's going to happen. If the WBC rubber stamp it, then the fight's going to happen, right? There's going to be no going to fight somebody else or whatever else, okay? So what is happening with this fight? It's been too long. Whenever Deontay Wilder talks, or his team talk, I should say, they always talk about an Anthony Joshua, or they talk about a fourth fight with Tyson Fury, or maybe fighting Alexander Usyk, or maybe a Francis Ngannou. Basically, anybody and everybody except Andy Ruiz Jr. Andy Ruiz Jr., he, ha he doesn't really do too many interviews, so we don't really know what he's thinking, other than he does feel Wilder doesn't want to fight him. Is this down to both of these want some kind of guarantee? Because it is a very interesting fight. It is a good fight, and it is a pay-per-view worthy fight. It is, right? But if the PBC are not giving out guarantees like they haven't with El Spence Jr. and Terence Crawford, then quite clearly there's trouble in paradise when it comes to Showtime and the PBC's budget, if you like. Maybe Paramount... Since they've uh, merged or taken over Showtime, are they going to close down boxing? Are they not going to release any kind of funds and whatever else? So what happens with this fight? Now, they could outsource it, if you like. I'm sure DAZN, Eddie Hearn, would put on this fight. I'm sure um, other platforms would. I'm sure maybe Top Rank would or maybe a, um, a, a, a Trillo or something. Okay? There's going to be other platforms to do it, but is our Heyman willing to do that? Unlikely. Andy Rich Jr. and Deontay Wilder are both going to want to get paid a good deal of money. But the PBC, like what they have been doing, is putting on anything and everything, pretty much pay-per-view. That's a way of saying we don't have the money and you guys will get paid whatever you generate at the box office. You do X amount of uh, pay-per-view buys, then you get paid this amount. If you don't, oh well. Which isn't fair, is it? So maybe that's why this fight's taking so long. Maybe it's a case of neither one of them is going to guarantee. Or maybe Deontay Wilder is saying, I ain't going to fight nobody, Mr. Al Heyman, until you pay me for my last fight. Because going by what Deontay Wilder said um, a couple of weeks ago, it appears that he ain't getting paid. Or at least not getting paid on time and things like that. I mean, that's the impression that we're getting. So maybe he's still waiting for his money. Maybe he's digging his heels in saying, you ain't paid me for my last fight. You think, I, you think I'm going to step foot through the ropes? Until you pay me, you got another thing coming. You're going to pay me before I step through in those ropes. Maybe Andrews Jr. hasn't been paid yet from the Luis Ortiz fight. You never know. Because there does seem to be trouble in paradise. Where is this fight? This fight should have been announced ages ago. Pretty much immediately after Deontay Wilder defeated Robert Hainis. We knew what the order was. Deontay Wilder, Andrews Jr. Maybe Andrews Jr. should have been there. Had a face-to-face -face in the ring. And now it's the fight. Could have had the date set. It's not like Wilder wasn't going to beat Hellenius, was it? So, anyway. If anybody knows more than what I do, please drop it in the comment section below. And I'll catch you all on the next video. Subscribe. <laughs>